joy of music. My name is Diane Bish and I would like to invite you to join us today as we bring you a program entitled Sights and Sounds from the Danube. Join us as we bring you music from historical churches and cathedrals in cities and towns found along the beautiful Danube River. Thank you for joining us. Today on The Joy of Music, our program of water music begins in Austria on the Danube as we travel from Vienna to Passau. The Danube is a most colorful waterway and our journey takes us by beautiful wooded hills, vineyards, medieval castles, ancient churches and abbeys, Rococo palaces, and colorful buildings and houses. The Wachau is the name given to the delightful stretch of the Danube between Melk and Krems in Lower Austria. Just 30 kilometers long, this belt of land basks in beautiful and exceptionally mild climate. Whatever your passion, the Wachau has something for everyone. As we travel by boat along the Danube, we see historical castles, churches, abbeys, cities and towns with colorful buildings and houses, vineyards and beautiful landscapes in every direction.
along the Danube, Bernstein is one of the most picturesque towns along the way. As we draw closer, we see the resplendent blue and white tower of the Stiftskirche, or monastic church, which is the centerpiece of the town. The church and castle are very colorful and are a favorite of tourists. can hear the name Danube without thinking of that most famous of Strauss waltzes on the beautiful blue Danube. Beautiful it certainly is, but to be honest, it's more a brownish yellow than blue, thanks to the lime stirred up from the riverbed. 
The Danube's romance lies in the medieval castles, Baroque churches and abbeys, Rococo palaces, and other beautiful sites that pass along as we travel on the Blue Danube. On our trip along the Danube, we arrive in Melk. The small town of Melk is world renowned for its magnificent Benedictine Abbey. One of the most excellent examples of Baroque architecture in Europe, the Abbey dominates the picturesque old town from high above the Danube River and houses a rich collection of art, as well as a magnificent organ.
On our journey on the Danube, we come to Passau, which is probably best known for its famous dome or cathedral, enthroned at the highest point of the town. This church was once Gothic in style, but was totally destroyed by fire and was replaced by an ornate building. Within the Passau Cathedral is one of the great organs of the world. And historically speaking, and even now today in the present, it is the world's largest church organ. With its many consoles and divisions found all over the church, it houses 17,000 pipes and is magnificent to hear. The opening of the Mine Danube Canal in September 1992 fulfilled the dreams of emperors and kings for over a thousand years. Modern technology has made the old dream come true, and the new canal is indeed one of the greatest engineering feats of the 20th century. Begun in 1921, the 106 mile canal connects the Rhine Mine rivers with the Danube. Thus, for the first time, connecting the North Sea with the Black Sea.
Our journey takes us along the Danube to Regensburg in the tribal days of the Dark Ages, the main seat of power. World War II left Regensburg relatively unscathed, and today Regensburg stands as one of the most beautiful medieval cities in all of Germany. At the center of Regensburg stands the beautiful cathedral. The Cathedral of Regensburg is known as the Dome and is Bavaria's most magnificent Gothic edifice. The church was begun around 1250, but was still incomplete in 1525 when work was suspended because of the Reformation. The upper part of the giant twin towers were erected in the mid-19th century. Of special note are the exterior sculptures on the cathedral and the canopied altars. The high altar is an elaborate Baroque creation made by Augsburg silversmiths. My name is Diane Vish, and I would like to thank you for joining us today on The Joy of Music, as we have brought you sights and sounds from the Danube. Today, music has come to you from historical churches and cathedrals, cities and towns, found along the beautiful Danube River. Thank you for joining us.
If you would like to purchase today's program or any program from our library of over 400, please visit our website at dianevishtv.com or call 1-800-933-4844. We look forward to hearing from you.